how could you? That's a terrible thing to say. Now, just calm down. Calm down? But you just insulted me and I don't stink, Diego. Oh. Well, sometimes the truth hurts, Lolita. I don't care, Diego. There are some things you just don't say to a lady. Here it is. I wish I'd never bought the stupid perfume. It was a waste of money. It smelled nice at first, but now it smells just awful. I thought that was your favorite perfume. You said you liked that one the best. Well, I did, but now it smells just horrible. What do you think I should do? Take it to the shop and ask for your money back. I can't do that. It's embarrassing. Of course you can't. That's the trouble with young people these days, never satisfied. I'll have you know that perfume made by Monsieur Charles is the best that money can buy. I never wear anything else, no. Hmm. Mm. <sighs> That's disgusting. Lolita! Bernardi's being horrible. I was only kidding. It smells nice, really. Look. Ugh. I told you he was being horrible! It didn't smell like that a minute ago! Oh! Ugh. He's doing it again! Is that new perfume? Mm-hmm. It's called Monsieur Charles! Oh. What? I'm not letting them get away with this! That's right! Go and tell them we want our money back or else! Okay! I want to come too! Oh, no, not another one. This is not our perfume. I can't help you, I'm afraid, miss. But this is a bottle of Mr. Charles' perfume, isn't it? Hmm. Well, it certainly looks the same. But the perfume is, how shall I say, a little different? Oh, this one's... Let me try, too. Here. Steady on, miss. So how do you explain your salesman selling fake perfume in the market? On a market stall? Yes. I remember there were two men selling the perfume from crates on the street corner. I'm sorry, miss, but we don't sell our goods outside on street corners. Then the stall was a fake and they were imposters. There have been so many people demanding their money back, I'm afraid that if this goes on... Expensive perfumes at rock-bottom prices! Huh? Ladies and gentlemen, today sees the opening of our new perfumery. Only one silver coin for the finest imported perfume. First come, first serve. Hurry, hurry! Thank you. Good day. One, please. Oh. Charming. I hope we have the pleasure of your custom again. I will definitely be coming again. I've never seen such expensive perfumes on sale so cheaply. I should tell all my friends about you. It is our policy, madam, that we only sell the best perfumes to the best people. Thank you, dear sir. You're so kind. I shall never buy perfume again from any other shop. <laughs> You're not buying anything else, are you, my dear? Oh, wait for me, my dear! Come along, Carlos! Oh. Oh. That's Mom and Dad. Well, that's it. My business is ruined now. Why don't you try and catch the ones who make the fake perfume? We've tried, but so far we've had no luck. Why don't we catch the criminals for you? What do you say, Lolita? Hmm, good idea, Nikita. We can't have them closing down this nice man's shop. Well, now, thank you for the offer, but it is hardly a job for two young girls. Hmm. If anyone can catch the criminals, we can. How are the sales figures looking, Burial? Is business good? Ha. Huh. These poor districts are a cinch. They're lapping it up. It's like taking candy from a baby. Easy money. Hmm. Just be careful. No one must know of your involvement with the fake perfume. Stop worrying. Everything is under control. No one is going to find out where the factory is. What a lovely perfume. Huh? <gasps>
I'm so glad our new Mother Superior insisted we plant all these flowers. Yes, these smell beautiful. It seems to follow you everywhere. Oh, oh. Hey. oh Nikita, what are we gonna do? I don't have the first idea about catching criminals, do you? What's the matter, Nikita? Don't you recognize those two men? Huh? Ah. It's them, I'm sure of it. I'm gonna look in that wagon. You stay right here. Huh? Something in the back. Oh. You're getting jumpy. There's nothing there. It's okay. Too much imagination. That's your trouble. <sighs> now to find out where they're hiding all the stuff. <laughs> oh! Ow! Ouch! Where are you off to in such a hurry? They've done what? How much further are they going? Hurry up, will you? Huh? Who are you? Mm? Oh, sister, uh, you startled me. I was wondering, did you see where they went? Who would that be, child? The two men who drove this wagon all the way here, sister. Two men here? You must be mistaken, my child. Men are not allowed into this convent. It is against the rules. Mm? What is happening, Sister Agnes? We have a visitor, Reverend Mother. Who are you, and what is your business with us, my child? Oh, uh, oh, well, I, I, um, I've got to think fast. I must find these men. They've got to be here hiding somewhere. I must have a good story. Yes. Oh, uh, please, Reverend Mother, don't turn me away. I beg of you. Oh, I'm in such terrible, terrible trouble. Please let me stay here. What do oh, you think, Reverend please. Mother? You may stay and rest a while, and later you can tell us what troubles you. I deserve an award for that performance. Now to have a good look around. Hmm, nothing much in here. <gasps> Can I be of help, child? Uh, no. I'm sorry. I think I must have come the wrong way. Which room are you looking for? Uh, uh, who are they? They are the new sisters. When our mother superior arrived, she brought them with her to help us. <gasps> it's them. What's the matter? What's in that building? Why, that's the library where we keep all our precious books and important papers. No one is allowed in there without the Mother Superior's permission. Oh.
It looks completely empty, but where could they have gone? <gasps> Why would they need guns at a convent? How's the work going? Everything's right on schedule, Mr. Burial. Good. Keep it moving. We must sabotage the Monsieur Charles stocks to increase the perfume sales of the South India Company. Monsieur Charles' perfume is so unpopular in Santasco, everyone is buying from us. That's good, but sales are still up in other towns. We must make sure our fake perfume ruins their trade. I am an expert in this sort of thing, and as a perfectionist, I expect perfection in everything I do. <laughs> huh? So, I've discovered their secret. I must tell everyone. <gasps> oh. Ah. Oh. Well, well, well. Seems we have a little spy in our midst. What a surprise. You made all the fake perfume just so people would buy from your company. You know, you really shouldn't get so worked up, my dear. I think it's time you cooled down a little bit. Oh. Oh. If we kill her now, the other nuns will be suspicious. We'll get rid of her later when we've finished here. Till then, lock her in the cellar. Do you really think she's in there, Bernard? She's gotta be. It's the only place for miles in the same direction that the wagon took. But we can't go sneaking about inside a convent, Bernard. <laughs> What are they going to do with me, I wonder? Figaro. She's here! Mm hmm. There's no other way, Bernard. We have to go in through the front gate, I'm afraid. Are we gonna break it down? I don't think so. There's still a lot we don't know about all this, Bernard. I daren't go bursting in there like a madman accusing the nuns of who knows what. No! We must play it safe. Yes! Hello! I brought the vegetable sisters! Oh. You're not the usual girl! Where is she? She's not well. I'm taking her place today. aren't very fresh. This one sounds rotten. We can't have that. I'm very sorry. I'll try and bring fresh ones tomorrow. Very well. Go quickly and deliver these to the kitchen. Ah. You can come out now, Bernard. Ha! I'll give her a rotten pumpkin. Oh. <sighs> no. Huh? Where did you come from? And how did you get in here, huh? Ah! <laughs> come back here, you mangy! <laughs> Lolita! Sorrow! Oh! Quick, we must get out of here. Since when did you start wearing makeup? Huh? Oh, come on, let's go. Not yet. There's something I have to do first. What's that? I have to get rid of all of this. There! Now they can't make any more perfume. Ah! Oh, I'm glad to see you. Some crooks have been using your cellar to make fake perfume. Isn't that awful? They must still be hiding somewhere. Perhaps you could help us look for them. Huh? Oh! Look out! Oh! 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 Zara, what are they 
doing? Surely the nuns aren't involved. Ha! Why is he running away? Zaro! I won't fight women, especially nuns from the convent. But Zaro, they're bad and they've got swords too. Fight them! Oh! Keep away from me! Oh, I'll show them. It's no good. I can't. <laughs> Lolita, where are you going? Be quiet and get a move on. could go off without warning. Walita? Get the guns. Move. Ah, okay. Oh! <gasps> huh? They're a man. They're in disguise. That's different. So you thought you would get away with your evil plan, but not anymore. Zaro will teach you to dishonor the Holy Sisters in this way. <laughs> What is the meaning of this? I suggest you leave this place at once. Oh, no, I'm not leaving here until you've explained yourself, Abbess. So you want an explanation? I think that I can explain for you. You can't escape! <laughs> You'll never find me! Zara! You can't see me, but I can see you very well. <laughs> this is crazy. I don't stand a chance in the dark. Uh. Give it up, Zorro. You'll never defeat a master like me. <laughs> oh, what's wrong? Why don't you speak? Nothing to say, eh? <laughs> It's no use, you fool. I can strike you down any time I want to. Time's up, Zorro. Say your prayers. Ah! How did you know where I was? I could smell you. What do you mean? You've been making that fake perfume for so long, the smell of it sticks to your clothes. You stink. So, my skills have worked against me. I could have made the best perfumes. I could have been rich! Ah! 
Yes, but they would have always smelt of corruption. Roll up, roll up, come and get your perfume, the cheapest prices in town. Once a lifetime bargain, not to be missed. Thank you, Miss Lolita. My perfume is selling better than ever now. You're welcome. I hope you'll carry on making your lovely perfumes. Now everyone knows about the criminals. Of course, and you'll be the first person to try my new perfume. Close down our perfume department. Yes, sir. Curse burial. He was full of empty promises. Okay, okay, wait a minute. I hope I never see another bottle of perfume again. <laughs> In the next exciting adventure, Zorro faces a new challenge. A mysterious oriental warrior arrives in town, and his magical powers soon prove to be more than a match for our masked hero. With Lolita's life at risk, the people's champion pulls off some incredible stunts to save him. But will he defeat the enemy that lurks in the shadowy forest? Find out in the next thrilling installment of Sorrow!